poppin youtube welcome back we are here with another mind melting brain exploding high experience known as maxer <laughs> with his hell divers 2 review oh my goodness gracious he is a bundle of chaotic brilliance and i love it and i'm surprised his pc has not given up yet because of all the pushing he puts it through Anyways, link to the description is the original video. Please go support his channel. Give it a like, give it a comment, do all that good stuff over there. And hey, while you're here, support this channel too, shoddy. Hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment down below to feed the algorithm. What? Check us out over on Twitch at Alicia X Life. Currently watching Alicia X Death, Alicia X Life is my Twitch. Anyways, let's get into it. Uh, many survival thought crimes. Helldivers 2 thought is an crimes. amazing co-op shooter that plays exactly like No Man's Sky, except instead of exploring the Whoa. cosmos, you uh, die horribly in the psalm. Every copy <laughs> of Helldivers 2 is uh, it is personalized. Joel wanted me to fight 10,000 fire ants in a. I don't want to cuss because she's nearby. <laughs> That's why I got quiet because I'm like, I don't want to be a bad bean when my mom just walked by. <laughs> my mom's walked by with my dog and he's like, oh, I'm just trying to see if I want to pack this clock for a housewarming gift. I'm like, oh, that's nice. And I'm here like, and I'm here like yeah, pussy every two seconds. So I'm just, I'm just here like, mm -hmm, yeah, okay. Yeah, I talk normally. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nervous laughter. <laughs> Universe where humanity is beset on all sides by curious wildlife and the actual Terminators, Super Earth. Super the Earth. galaxy's last and only bastion of managed democracy no. sends its finest men, women, and children over seven to liberate and spread freedom. Woohoo! Freedom! Hellscapes known to man, where war crimes are not only justified, they're but encouraged. Are necessary. Oh, we necessary. Okay. The... I was like, war crimes are encouraged. <laughs> <laughs> what is what's the thing that you guys always say in chat? Like Geneva suggestions or some shit? <laughs> Hell divers, humanity's finest in emancipation and friendly fire incidents. But uh, oh. there's no need to worry about that last one because dude, the videos of me playing with my friends and us killing each other, so satisfying, <laughs> so satisfying. Well, incredibly expendable. All across the galaxy, Liberty's enemies march ever closer. But through the power of teamwork, friendship, and 500 kilogram bombs, we will fight for freedom, for democracy, and most importantly, because it's really funny. Dudes be like, Helldivers 2 is military propaganda. My brother in Christ, it worked. Triple the defense budget. Whoa! Let's go! <laughs> Needs more boom. <laughs> the first thing you'll notice upon entering the SES Judge of Judgment is the incredibly stupid name. And yes, you are able to name it other things using the Wizard 101 naming scheme. <laughs> things like the Pride of Pride, Star of the Stars. I named mine Queen of something. Queen of Serenity? Some shit like that. It's something with a Sailor Moon reference. <laughs> I don't remember fully. Patriot of patriotism and my personal favorite, the founding father of family values, because this game has a lot of violence in movies. Oh. oh, here you see me depicted as the soy wojack. The second <laughs> thing you'll notice upon entering the bridge is the ongoing galactic war, and that we are currently fucking losing the galactic war. Yeah. Which is why we need to suit up with exactly three of our friends and choose which planet is in vital need of the democratic process. Oh, Jesus. If you don't have any friends, then, uh, I hope you can speak good Mandarin. I think I did something to make him mad. But to win the Galactic War... Have y'all experienced that when you were playing with randoms? <laughs> Anyone? Anyone? I only dealt with dudes who were just stoned as shit, who sounded like they were like 35. <laughs> yeah, man, uh... Yeah, I think it's um over there. <laughs> that's 
That's what I... I never experienced anybody else besides that. <laughs> or just someone too nervous because they heard me talk and they're like... Uh... Yeah. Uh, we, we, we can... Yeah, let's, let's do that. <laughs> it's one or the other. And I'm like, okay, maybe I should. <laughs> we must first understand the Galactic War. We can ill afford another Malevolon Creek, which is why I'm going to go I've never with dealt with anyone who was toxic towards me for being a woman, though, which was kind of based. Like, when you play, like, Valorant, or you play, like, pretty much anything else with, like, voice comms that has a super large player base, normally you get, like, a lot of sexism. Helldivers never did. I was always having a chill time. It's a lot of stone dudes vibing. <laughs> each of the two fronts that are currently reducing us to smears across the galaxy. And uh, I'm going to do it at difficulty 7 or above, which is coincidentally oh, okay. the perfect enlistment age. On the oh, hell no. The political spectrum, oh, hell the no. Automaton front. Yes to the enlistment age of being 7, but hell no to the difficulty level. Jesus. Enemy focusing on range tactics, heavy armor in slight excess, and an extremely high amount of... Explosive ordnance. Kaboom! If that sounds a little bit intimidating, then don't worry. I haven't even gotten to the horde of angry chainsaws yet. Chainsaw man records go in the video here. Chainsaw! But talking about the autonomous front chainsaw. is never complete without covered. talking about the fucking creek, or as it is known by our honored veterans, Space Vietnam. This oh, okay. <laughs> has been single-handedly responsible for most of our casualties. Damn! Is this SpongeBob? And that is <laughs> genuinely impressive, considering that uh, a million out. <laughs> men have already died in the Battle of the Madagascar Lemur. Those are considered rookie numbers, and we're already outpacing the Taiping Rebellion. In fact, every single military operation we conduct is in a, some way related to Malevolon Creek. And personally, I don't really see what all the hype is about. After all, it's just one planet. How important could one planet possibly be? Uh. Holy shit. My brain. We will unlock the secrets of the universe. God has laid them out like Christmas presents for his children. Boot camp's got fucking weird recently. <laughs> Level on Creek and by extension. Dude, my brain. <laughs> but honestly, even though he edits kind of crazy, which I do enjoy, the game just feels like that. <laughs> It just feels like constant kabooms all the time. <laughs> My brain. <laughs> the rest of the front is essentially an exercise in how much PTSD one man can possibly get. Their oh. firepower is so overwhelming, so absolutely constant, that describing it as an endless retreat where you accidentally accomplish all of your objectives would oh. be very generous, as it implies that I do the objectives. Fucking shit. This can occasionally push you into what we call um, unfortunate tactical positions. Oh. At which point, your main options for survival are going to be uh, watching your slower friends get burned to death in the make -off. Oh! I will never unhear that scream. So <laughs> yes, this planet may be- <laughs> Just the shriek of terror as the fire comes. Dude, in my, in my Helldivers video, one of them where Azu has like the flamethrower for the first time, he burned me? And I was like, hey, can you stop doing that? Like, I just annoyed as shit. I saw shit like that. And there was another time where, uh, I, I, <laughs> where they called, what? It's not an aerial strike. It's like a different type of strike. But it's like the laser beam from God. And I just screamed, honey, no! <laughs> as my fiance killed me. <laughs> oh, it was Bao. Oh. What the economists call a bad use of our human capital. But after dealing with several days of what I can only describe as angry oh. forklift decommissioning. Oh shit, this motherfucker. Is it bad? My way of knowing Bao is through the like, is it like, what do they call it? Like the feeding? The chunky memes? I don't know what they call, I don't know what you're supposed to call that. So, uh, <laughs> Okay, I don't, I don't know, I don't know. Okay, that's, you guys know, you guys are more VTuber filled than I am. Yes, I don't. <laughs> Inflation. Oh, I've never. Okay, yeah, I'm learning. <laughs> that's how I know Val is from that. <laughs> it's not OSHA certified. So I know of Val. Step letter for that, sir. 
Okay, call me crazy, but I think there's a turret around this corner, guys. Oh! I fucking hate the creek. <laughs> I can safely say that the attachment has become fucking personal. And honestly... Which, I by the way, just, just really quick, because I knew about that from Twitter drama where people were mad about her doing that at the same time that Kenji got the new model where he was, like, supposed to be a like, South Park reference. Come on. <laughs> You have better things in life to fight besides VTuber designs. Chill the fuck out. <laughs> There's better fights for you to pick. Come on. <laughs> oh no, VTuber designs. Oh no, VTuber jokes they have with each other. Who gives that much of a shit? Like, come on. <laughs> or if you just don't like them, just don't watch them. Like, I don't see the big... Just cringe. <laughs> like, cringe. If you don't like someone, just don't watch them. There's no reason to shit on them for doing what they want to do. Also, Kenji's model is pretty fucking funny. <laughs> so, I don't know. I feel like a lot of the drama that happens around a lot of VTubers is just kind of dog shit. The ones that, like, I don't fuck with, though, are, like, the the VTubers who, like, either steal models or shit like that. Like, that stuff's fucked up. But I don't really get involved in anything. But, you know, it is what it is. If you don't like somebody, just don't fuck with them. Oh, uh -huh. Instead of shitting all over them. I want to see how many bodies one planet can hold. We lost Vietnam. We lost Afghanistan. And yes, Oops. we definitely lost America. <gasps> so goddamn it, I'm yeah. not going to lose this shit to ones and zeros. God oh. gave this galaxy to a non-binary species. And service guarantees gender affirmation. Oh. Uh, fun facts about the bot front. Number 10. Man urinates on fellow passenger for not being allowed to smoke. Number oh. nine, if you happen to make the mistake of fighting here, you're quickly going to realize that most of our forces are Chinese, each one taking glorious revenge against the steel plants they work in. Very auspicious behavior. What? And conversely, <laughs> we Guilo have been sent by our barbarian prince to fight the hordes of angry roaches, for it is the God-given right of the defense lobby to remind the bugs. understand the game to that extent to make the perfect satire is so fucking based god damn it <laughs> there's so many mo fuckers who i've seen not understand the game and what they're trying to accomplish well enough and when someone understands the game and makes fucking jokes like that it hits so good it hits so good <laughs> that it is man who was made in god's image Really can't wait to die. Media literacy is usually dead. <laughs> legally distinct. Makes me happy when I say that's not. The terminated front. Sorry. The terminated population problem is a wide <laughs> assortment of increasingly horrifying demons, each one abandoned by their creators in completely different ways. Ah. Uh, my, my guy's got a bad case of the rigor mortis. Oh, We've got small goodbye. bugs, big bugs, immortal bugs, bugs that function as artillery, and of course. Oh. The bugs that stalk you at night. Thankfully oh, for us, though, oh. Napalm is an equal opportunity employer. And, uh, a lot of positions are open right now. That is to say, once you start fighting the bugs, you do not stop for about 40 minutes or so. Holy because, uh, shit! Because, spawned a battalion from the ground like the goddamn Viet Cong for the third time in a row. I've never played on this level of difficulty, so seeing this is just... <laughs> this is overwhelming. How do you... How do you make it through? Oh my god. Good fucking throw, dude. I, I just want to walk to the McDonald's, guys. I'm just oh. a level one goblin. I just want my it's nuggets. my birthday. I'm a little birthday boy. Oh no. And do you want to know the worst part about this war? We uh don't really know how they move between planets. And I don't think they have what you would call a plan. Rather, the oh. Terminated simply appear in places they wish to eviscerate. Kind of like a Whole Foods. So, oh. uh, you can imagine my shock when I learned that those white bitches were trying to gentrify the moon. They are ruining the amazing local- <laughs> We got a free run reference, but at what cost? <laughs> but at what cost? <laughs> Culture of, uh... Oh. California. I hope it's becoming obvious that fighting these things under normal circumstances is what we call a uh, same-day shipping to God. 
Oh, sh yep. Yeah, that's fast. What the fuck? <laughs> this is why Amazon employees like pee in fucking bottles, dude. Because <laughs> same day shipping to God is extremely quick. And they gotta go. They gotta go for their Bezos bucks. <laughs> for us, though, we have access to a wide variety of unique and hilarious tools, which are only accessible via inputting a series of hand signs, informally known as airstrike jutsu. Whether it's big airstrikes. I'm so sorry. I. Someone said skip the heaven line, but my brain is so fucking rotted. I read it as like, as like, <laughs> like skipping as in like when you're doing a speed run and you do a skip. And I'm like, my brain just fucking. <laughs> That's on me because I was watching Games Done Quick recently. <laughs> and I I'm so brain rotted. <laughs> Oh my god, not even skipping a line didn't even make sense to me because I was like, oh yeah, 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 like sk skipping in a game, yeah, yeah, <laughs> And realizing how far I've gone. Yeah, that's a brain rot level up. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. <laughs> it's, it's, I don't go outside. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> I need to start going outside and interacting with humans more. This is this is getting real bad. <laughs> Only accessible via inputting a series of hand signs, informally known as airstrike jutsu. Do, 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 do. Airstrikes, airstrikes, <laughs> biggest airstrike the engine can sustain, or airstrikes that specialize in killing everything except the enemy. <laughs> there are so many bad guys with so much damage to be done that the most challenging part oh? is keeping your team out of the blast radius. I got 500 kilograms ready. Oh, shit, no. oh, God, oh, 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 what have you fucking done? Oh, and shit! Yes, you do have to throw them, which means you can drop them, throw the wrong asset, oh, and no. even attach them to enemies that are running into you. My personal favorite combination is definitely the napalm and chlorine gas for when you really, really oh. want your enemies to feel pain. Inside and out. We also offer a gluten free variety. Now, of course, oh, well, airstrikes nice. aren't the only thing we <laughs> oh. can deliver, just most of them. Because here at the Defense Department, we take care to provide, to, to provide, to provide, why can't I say words? A wide array of support oh. tools. And by support tools, you did a good job, you said at the, the end. Machine gun, which are crucial and necessary for fighting a uh, literally anything. <laughs> We've got flamethrower. Okay, I don't know. Bottom text memes where it just says bottom text makes my brain happy. <laughs> When I'm editing subtitles for some of my videos, I'm like, it just, mm, thank you. <laughs> Jetpacks, automatic lasers that demand human sacrifice. Oh! American police taser with unlimited ammo, automatic targeting, and a vendetta against teammates. Holy shit. Really in the general direction, <laughs> the cry of pain from that man. He's like Napoleonic line infantry. It also has two fire modes called safe mode and unsafe mode. And Jesus! Giant death robots that randomly explode sometimes. Those are so fun to- oh. <laughs> that is the last time I buy a fucking Tesla. My uh, <laughs> personal favorite strategy involves everyone giving their mechs to the designated disabled man, who will proceed to stay inside of six different wheelchairs for 40 minutes. What? And as a caveat, <laughs> we force him to crawl on the ground between mechs for immersion reasons. But honestly, <laughs> all of these fantastic- you can't break my immersion. Yes. <laughs> Crawl. <laughs> ...tools absolutely pale in comparison to the fast and convenient resupply of Gamer Sup's energy drinks. Here to huh? give you a fantastic boost to your gaming abilities, which, if you want to win this battle, I will now expect of you. We in the Chinese are not going to be taking back Osto 2 on eight hours of sleep. I'm sorry. But, uh, he was... Okay, he is going- okay, this is still the Gamer Subs sponsorship segment. I was like, wait, is the sponsorship segment over? No, it's- no, it, this is still it. Okay. It did also release a sleep aid. In case somebody gives you too much okay. energy. Okay. <laughs> How am I getting away with this shit? Gamer Subs <laughs> comes in many different flavors, such as Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000, Grandpa's Ashes, and, uh, good. It's, a. Uh, it's just- good. I haven't tried All good. at the low price of 40 cents per stratagem. Which is literally cheaper than the dirt I am dying over. I uh went to Amazon and checked. So if you oh, are okay, still yep, watching fair this enough. video somehow, <laughs> and uh, 
God bless you if you are. You can have Gamersups delivered with 10% off by opening the description and clicking the special stratagem code. What else do we have? Uh, uh, we have guides in case you really don't want to play the game, as well as a strange amount of priorities. Honestly, he did a fantastic sponsor segment there. Just wanted to compliment that. That was sick. Child safe. Can't wait for the devs to nerf this one and say some shit like, Sorry, Helldivers. Command sent us Rigatoni instead of Railgun Shells. No! Now, in this kind of environment with <laughs> Throw the Rigatoni! <laughs> Come on! are not just expected. They are required. You uh, don't really get to 12 million by being an easy game, which is why, upon the occurrence of my teammate's tragic passing, I will gain the ability to replace my friends with a legally distinct Helldiver, ready to fight and die <laughs> for the worst planets you have ever seen. Like my brother in Christ, you Jeez. are fighting over the Arizona Ice Tea world. Missions in this game are usually comprised of exploring new and At least fantastic it's pretty. worlds, and then building a Walmart super center on them. Local residents be damned. To that end, we have a great diversity of Aww. missions, like geological surveys, rescuing civilians who move their heads like confused avians, <laughs> He's like <a> chicken, <laughs> spreading industrial <laughs> amounts of carcinogenic gas, and launching the fucking nuclear missile. We did it, Patrick. We saved Istanu, along with a myriad of side objectives, Aww. which usually boil down to uh, killing everything that moves, and occasionally, Loving a gun that will do it for you. We uh, don't really talk about the eradicate missions because they tend to play themselves. All in service oh. to liberate a planet by an astounding 0.0003%. Yeah, but honestly, one of the coolest parts, especially at launch, was like when, well, I played a little bit after launch, but when you got to see like how much things would progress over the course of a few days, I thought it was really cool. And, like the fact that we contribute so little, but there's so many players, just made it feel really cool. I don't know. I, I like that aspect, even though it feels it, it, like we statistically did barely anything. It kind of gives more of an immersion to it. This isn't a <laughs> fucking charity, all right? Reach one. Yeah, exactly, exactly. No handouts, exactly. The very next day, <laughs> he gets I am it. <laughs> currently reporting to you from the fifth season. The top and bottom text. Yes. And hell divers also have a unique blend of beautiful environments. Like the Heaven Planet, where huh? it is impossible to escape God's light. The uh, Constant Meteor Storm Planet, where it is illegal to stand still. The okay. <laughs> Fire Tornado Planet. The uh, weird fucking I've planet. never seen that. What I'm the fuck is this? You, uh, what? Genghis oh, this shingles ring. It's goddamn No Man's Sky. Oh my god. I got fucking duped for a second. I was like, I've never seen this. My brain got... I was like, what? <laughs> I'm like, oh wait. He edited it so seamlessly, my brain got confused. Holy shit! <laughs> and the planet that before it was removed from the game. It's editing too smooth, man. <laughs> which made the process of calling a resupply much more interesting. Oh! Please put this back in the game. Look, Helldivers is a game that gives you a lot of tools and a lot of places to use them. So honestly, the task of describing it all to you is uh <laughs> not my fucking job. The developers Fair are enough. literally adding things faster than I can show them to you. I uh, began making this video before mechs existed. So inevitably, oh. when the day comes that Arrowhead adds the secret third faction that we don't legally know anything about, I guess I'll be making a video about it. As long as this one gets views. Overall, uh... Helldivers 2 is an absolute chaotic mess where every mission begins and ends with the assumption that we are not going to make it. And yet, somehow, some way, I still find a way to disappoint my friends. Some may consider <laughs> oh, it difficult, no. while others may consider it fucking bullshit. But personally, surviving against all odds in the face of complete, absolute absurdity is a big reason that I still love this game. No matter how many game-breaking bugs they introduce. Uh, sorry, Helldivers. Honestly, it is super satisfying when, when you make it out, though. Yeah. Like, especially during a hard run. They play on a way harder so difficulty high than high I do. It causes That's even crazier. <laughs> and with the Galactic War still ongoing, our story of spreading managed democracy has only just begun. We have the ships. <laughs> we have the weapons. We need soldiers. <laughs> soldiers like the uh, angry Chinese guy. Service guarantees affordable health care. They'll keep fighting and they'll win. As long as the bug front plays the game today, on a more personal note, the Ministry oh? of Truth extends its gratitude to all of its very kind patrons, enabling and financing our propaganda on a truly galactic scale. I... Your money is being put to excellent use, making God damn only it. the funniest <laughs> and most original content. Anyways, uh, time to report to my execution now. 
Woohoo! Honestly, just another amazing Maxer video. Obviously, link to the description below is the original video. Please go support that. And wow, you guys instantly recognize the Nikki music, which honestly says a lot about you and how much you play the shooting ass game. Well, you do watch me. You do watch VTubers. That makes sense, actually. That does check out. <laughs> Anyways, I just want to say thank you so much for watching and hanging out with me. I do reactions. I play video games. Currently, my main computer is in the repair shop, so I'm doing a lot more reactions right now. But normally, when my PC works, I do a lot of video games. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you in the next one, and we'll see you next time. Bye!